Time to Chat with Guitar Animal, and that is Southern Cross by Crosby, Stills & Nash. Great song. I love the song. The harmony vocals and the guitar line in the back are just awesome. It's a fairly easy song to play. I've been wanting to bring this to you for a while, so today we're going to go over it. And uh, don't forget, GuitarAnimal.com will have a companion video to this one, which will have additional details and more parts to the song. So, to start this song, we're going through several chords. We're going to be using an A chord, A major which is going to be the 2nd fret of your 2nd, 3rd, and 4th strings and your open 5th string, that's A. Then we're going to play a G5 chord, which requires the 3rd fret of the 1st, the 2nd, and the 6th strings. I'm going to also let my middle finger that's holding that 6th string mute out the 5th string so we don't hear that. So I strum across all 6 strings, but you do not hear the 5th string ring. That's called a G5. <clears throat> we switch to a D chord which is your second fret on your first string, your third string, and third fret on your second string, as well as the open fourth string, that's our D. Only other chord we're gonna be using is a G, B chord. It's actually the inside strings of a G chord. We're gonna be playing the third fret of the second string, the open third string, the second fret of the fifth string, and I'm muting out the fourth string there, and we just do that for a brief moment. We just hit it one strum. So this first section, the intro, will go like this. Two strikes on the A, two strikes on the G5, two strikes on the D, and then the GB, one strike, and then back to the D. So I'll play it slowly. Then we're gonna do the exact same thing again, but at the end, instead of ending on the D, we're gonna end on the A chord. So it'll be like this. A, G, B, B, G, B, A. All right, so I'll play through that one more time slowly. And that's the intro to the song. At this point, we're gonna go into the verse. The verse section will be the same chord change, but a different rhythm. The rhythm will change to this. Instead of just two strikes on a chord with silence after it, it'll be this. A, G, B, and then A, G, B, B, A. All right, so I'll do that slowly. ring and then now in the original recording you will hear multiple guitar tracks as well as a 12 string in there really like the 12 string sound in there but I wanted to do this on a six because I think more people have six string guitar so make sure you check us out at guitaranimal.com I will cover additional parts to this song we have slowdown features looping functions and the tablature that I'm working from as well as a link to the video that I worked with to do this song hope you're enjoying it I'm Trent with Guitar Animal thanks for tuning in